Hey everyone, welcome back. And in today's video, we're gonna be talking about the pros and cons of cloud-based antivirus solutions. Nowadays, cyber attacks are becoming increasingly sophisticated and traditional antivirus solutions are struggling to keep up with the pace of malware evolution and cybercrime. This has led to the emergence of cloud-based antivirus solutions, which offer a faster and much effective approach to cybersecurity. And so in today's video, we're gonna take a look at the pros and cons of cloud-based antivirus solutions to highlight both their advantages and potential shortcomings. Now, before we get into this video, if you're looking for a cloud-based antivirus, I'll be leaving some in-depth reviews on antiviruses that I personally recommend along with some discounts in the description down below. For starters, what exactly is a cloud-based antivirus? Well, cloud-based antivirus is a security solution that uses cloud infrastructure for threat detection and analysis. Instead of relying solely on local software and signature-based methods, cloud-based antivirus solutions send suspicious files or data to remote servers in the cloud for real-time scanning and analysis. This approach allows for faster and more effective threat detection, automatic updates, reduced impact on local system resources, and centralized management, enhancing overall cybersecurity protection. With that being said, let's get into all the pros of cloud-based antiviruses. For starters, we have real-time threat detection and response. One of the most significant advantages of cloud-based antiviruses is their ability to provide real-time threat detection and response. Traditional antivirus software relies on signature-based detection which needs frequent updates to recognize new threats. Whereas cloud-based solutions can use the power of the cloud to analyze threats in real time, allowing for faster and more effective protection against emerging threats. Another pro is gonna be that cloud-based solutions have a minimal impact on system resources. Cloud-based antiviruses are often less resource intensive on local systems compared to traditional antivirus software. This is because a lot of the heavy lifting, such as threat analysis and database updates is offloaded to remote servers in the cloud, which would lead users to experience improved system performance, reduced energy consumption, and longer device lifespans. Next up, we have scalability and flexibility. Cloud-based antiviruses are highly scalable and can adapt to the evolving needs of businesses and individuals. They can easily accommodate new users, devices, and locations without needing significant infrastructure investments. Also, cloud-based solutions can provide the flexibility to manage security remotely, making them ideal for organizations with distributed workforces. Another pro that cloud-based antiviruses have is its centralized management. Cloud-based antivirus solutions often come with centralized management consoles that allow IT administrators to monitor and manage security across multiple device and endpoints from a single interface. This streamlines the process of deploying updates, configuring policies, and responding to threats making it much easier to maintain a strong security plan. Other than that, cloud-based antiviruses can automatically receive and deploy updates without user intervention. This makes sure that security is always up to date, protecting against the latest threats. Automatic updates are especially important nowadays, as new malware variants and vulnerabilities are constantly emerging. With that being said, this type of antivirus is not exactly perfect, as it does come with a few challenges. For example, cloud-based antivirus solutions depend on a constant and stable internet connection. If the internet connection is lost or disturbed, the effectiveness of these solutions may be compromised. This limitation can be a concern for users in areas with unreliable internet access or during network outages. Another con would be the privacy and data security concerns. Storing sensitive security data in the cloud can raise privacy and data security concerns. Some users and organizations may be hesitant to trust third-party providers with their security data, fearing potential breaches and data leaks or misuse. And so picking an antivirus with a reputable background such as Total AV is a must when it comes to cloud-based antiviruses. Other than that, the cloud-based nature of these solutions can introduce latency into the scanning and detection process. When files or data need to be sent to remote servers for analysis, there can be a delay in identifying and mitigating threats. This delay may not be suitable for the scenarios where you need an immediate response. However, most modern antivirus solutions like Total AV would run both online and offline. Though keep in mind that you do need to connect to the internet frequently to install the recent updates. So to sum it up, cloud-based antivirus solutions are a promising approach to cybersecurity that comes with a bunch of benefits 
like real-time threat detection, minimal system resource impact, scalability, and centralized management. These advantages have made them an appealing option for individuals and businesses alike. However, there are also important drawbacks, such as internet dependency, privacy concerns, and latency issues, which should be carefully considered. Ultimately, the choice between traditional and cloud-based antivirus solutions depends on your individual needs, preferences, and risk tolerance. You should evaluate the specific advantages and disadvantages in the context and weigh them against your cybersecurity priorities. And that's it for today's video on the pros and cons of cloud-based antiviruses and how they measure up to traditional ones. Now, regardless of which type you choose, I'll be leaving some in-depth reviews on some antiviruses that I personally recommend along with some discounts to help you pick software that fits your needs. Also, if you liked the content or found it useful, make sure to like the video and subscribe to see more of it. And if you have any questions or suggestions, don't hesitate to leave them in the comments as I love to interact with you guys. And that will be all for today and I'll see you in the next one.